Welcome back to the channel. It is your host Rob with i25 Kia. To continue our look at the top of the line 2020 Kia models, we're here today with Kia Soul EX. It's pretty sweet. So there are many things that really make Kia Soul shine. One of them being its very unique look. There aren't many vehicles out on the road that have this boxy shape. So it's very recognizable. So let's walk around this vehicle, check out the exterior, and then we'll take it for a spin. I'll tell you guys what I like about it. So most of the soles look the same. They're always different colors, but when you buy the EX package, you can get the two-tone. So this is the gray paint job with the gold roof and the gold mirrors. You get different wheels. These are an 18 inch alloy with the unique black spoke design that's particular to the EX trim levels. You've got LED lighting for the entirety of this vehicle, including the fog lights, the daytime running lights, the rear tail lights. So the Soul's just surrounded by details, including things like the Soul logo. So let's pull out our trusty key fob and let's hop in. All right, we're inside. If you're a returning viewer to this channel, then you already know what we need to do. We gotta buckle you in. Even though this is one of Kia's safest cars in their lineup, you still gotta be safe. So you have a push button start that has the idling feature, which is a great thing to have if you care about the environment. And for the driver, you also have a 10-way power adjusted seat. All right, I lost count honestly. Oh, in that way, in this way. Oh, and you have the lumbar. Sweet. So for the driver, this is designed to fit like a glove. So on the interior of this guy, you have a Sofino leather and a cloth for these seats. I like the nice details they've put on the inside of the doors. The steering wheel is very nice. It's covered in leather. On the left, you can navigate through your phone calls, your music, change the volume, hit your mute. And on the right, you've got your cruise control. For the driver and the passenger, you both get heated seats. You can find the buttons right here in the center console. And you've got two different settings in case you have a really cold butt. But when you first hop into this ride, the first thing you're gonna notice is this 10.25 inch touchscreen display. This is what Kia likes to call the nerve center for this car. With its available voice command, navigation, Sirius XM, satellite radio, and HD radio. This touchscreen relays real time highway conditions, your weather. You can customize each one of these panels to be whatever you want it to be. Right now I've got it set up where I've got my maps on the left, my music in the middle, and my weather on the right. And the screen looks great for things like Apple CarPlay. You can either use the touch screen or the steering wheel to navigate through your phone calls. You can access your maps, go through all of your music. You can even go through your text messages right here on this gigantic screen. I really like how they've got this shiny black detailing around the whole screen. It, it makes it look bigger. It's a very clean look. Let's test out the performance of this guy. There are many reasons I like driving Kia Soul. One of them being these gigantic windows. Here in Colorado, driving around with these big boxy windows is awesome. It provides a more scenic drive and it's a lot more enjoyable. And I also like how the Soul sits. Like I feel high up. Even though I'm not, I don't feel like I'm in a small vehicle. I know I've said that before, but right out the gate, it's not what you expect. The two liter four cylinder engine comes with 147 horsepower, but honestly, it's an impressive get up and go. I would best describe this car as zippy. It does come included with separate drive modes. You've got normal and sport. Also comes jam packed with safety features. I'm talking about forward collision avoidance, lane keep assist, driver attention warning, blind spot collision warnings, lane change assist, and even when you're using the backup camera, you also have the rear cross traffic alert. So you're not gonna back up into any bicyclists zipping by you while you're trying to leave. So yeah, I'm a big fan of Kia Soul. It's definitely a car you need to test drive because you're not really gonna fully experience how awesome it is until you start driving it. I hope I've better informed you guys about the Kia Soul EX, the 2020. If you guys have any further questions about this ride, go talk to the car experts at i25 Kia. Or if you wanna test drive it, take advantage of our 24 hour home test drive. No matter where you live at in Colorado, we'll deliver the car to you. You have a full 24 hours to do whatever you want with it. And if you want to buy it, we'll bring over the paperwork, we'll take it back, we'll clean it, we'll bring it back to you, and the car is yours. As always, thank you guys for tuning in. Check back soon for more content, and have a great day. Bye.